Let's now combine match and group stages. In this example, we will first use match stage, where we will find all documents with favorite fruit banana. And next, group stage. And finally, we will get documents with underscore ID that will have embedded document with two fields age and eye color. So remember that all documents in person's collection will go to match stage first. We will filter and find only documents with favorite fruit banana. And then resulting documents will go to the group stage. And group will produce brand new documents that will contain all possible combinations of age and eye color of the documents that came out from the match stage. Results will be following. So documents with one field underscore ID and this field will contain document as a value and this document will have two fields age and eye color. And here we see all possible combinations of age and eye color. Let's look at this in action. In previous examples we used just one stage. So let's add one more stage here. I'll copy all those contents. Copy and paste here. And rename stage 1 to stage 2. So here instead of group I will use match stage. And let me delete all contents of the value. Like this. So let's group results by eye color and age. So I will remove this part. Here it is. And let's match documents by for example gender. Gender female. So I am matching documents by gender female. Here I need to add comma. And then group resulting documents by eye color and age. Let's execute this operation. And I got results. Eye color blue, age 27 and so on. And I got more than 50 such pairs. To ensure that all documents in the results have gender female, we can add gender as a field here. So gender and reference to the gender field in the input documents. And let's execute this command enter. And of course all resulting documents will have gender female. Here it is. Ok, let's summarize what happens here. All documents from the person's collection are passed to the first stage, that is a match stage. We filter documents and find only those where gender is female. Then those documents are passed to the stage 2, that is a group stage. And we group those documents by eye color, by age and by gender. And as a result we get brand new documents with one field underscore id as a value it has embedded document and this embedded document has three fields eye color, age and gender. And those fields represent all possible combinations of the values of eye color, age and gender in the documents that we got after the first stage match. Ok, what will happen if we will simply change order of those stages? So just swap them. Let's look at this next. See you shortly.